Welcome. Five nights at Candy Springs again. So we're gonna continue night two. And maybe go to night three if if I have time. No, that's bad. No, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. Come on, come on, come on, fix, 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 fix. Woo. Oh my gosh, I'm so close.
go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. We got it. We win. We're great. We're gonna punch him out. Can you collect more in one part? Blank go blank and blank. Let's go into night three because we can.
believe it's night three. Alright. 70-year-old girl, Marilyn Smith, did not show up for school yesterday after she had to legally was staying overnight with a friend in this week. In this week, Marilyn's friend later revealed that Marilyn was spending the night in the abandoned factory on St. Antonia's Road and that they had lied to Marilyn's parents. Marilyn had lost a bed with some of her classmates where she had to spend five nights in the factory. A search party was assembled. They looked for things around the factory for the most of for most of the rest of yesterday, but she could not be found. I will see you in the next video because that's always happening.